from the last benches of the classroom could you please tell us what made you to believe in the last bench today? because i was the last bench <laughs> even i do india celebrates world students day on october 15 every year the day is marked to celebrate the birth anniversary of dr apj abdul kalam people's president as dr kalam was popularly known served as india's 11th president from 2002 to 2007 apj abdul kalam was born on October 15 1931 to a muslim family his father was janulabdin marakayar and his mother was ashiamma he was born in rameshwaram on pambam island as a young boy he had to sell newspapers in order to add to the family's meager income He spent hours on his studies, especially mathematics. After completing his education at the Squires Higher Secondary School, Ramanandapuram, Kalam went on to attend St. Joseph's College, Tiruchirappalli, then affiliated with the University of Madras from where he graduated in physics in 1954. He then moved to Madras in 1955 to study aerospace engineering in Madras Institute of Technology. He started his career by designing a small hovercraft but remained unconvinced by his choice of job at the DRDO. He was a part of the Incospar committee working under Vikram Sarabhai in 1969 Kalam was transferred to ISRO. Kalam served as the chief scientific advisor to the prime minister and to the secretary of the defense research and development organization from the July 1992 to December 1999 the pokhran 2 nuclear tests were conducted with his intensive role In 1998, Kalam with Soma Raju developed a low-cost coronary stent called the Kalam Raju stent. Kalam became the 11th president of Independent India on 25th July 2002. He was known as the People's President and was the third president of India to have been honored with the Bharat Ratna. He was the first scientist and the first bachelor to occupy Rashtrapati Bhavan. His some of his notable works are Wings of Fire, India 2020, Ignited Minds, Indomitable Spirit, Transcendence, My Spiritual Experiences with Pramukh Swami. His biggest achievement was his dedication which led to the development of four missile projects namely prithvi trishul akash nag and due to this contribution he earned the title the missile man of india on 27th of july 2015 Kalam traveled to Shillong to deliver a lecture on creating a livable planet Earth at the Indian Institute of Management Shillong. While climbing a flight of stairs, he experienced some discomfort but was able to enter the auditorium after a brief rest at around 6:35 p.m. Only 5 minutes into his lecture, he collapsed. बड़ा खूबसूरत है जहाँ